Hey everyone, Just for Sweets here. Haven't made a video in a long time, so I wanted to invite you guys in. Um, back uh, when my channel first started, you know, I did a lot of uh, recipes with some really amazing foods. And then I went on a journey where I lost some weight and I gave some really healthy tips. I have smoothie recipes out there. I have craft ideas out there. Um, I've also done some motivational stuff, but today um, I am back on my health journey. I've been back on it for about, uh, well, it seems like like strict been back on it since March uh, when my cholesterol levels came back high and I am going to be 50 next week. So I have to kind of get things in check because I don't want to be on a bunch of medication. So the point of this video today is that I am sharing with you a few ideas for low carb, low sugar uh, snacks, not necessarily meal replacements. These are more of snacks or like if you have a sweet tooth um, to cure that sweet tooth without like going overboard. Don't get me wrong. I just had a bite of cake <laughs> for my husband's birthday. Uh, the other night, but because um, I'm having a massive sweet tooth right now, but then I stopped myself after the bite and I was like, okay, no, that's not a good decision. Now, since March, I've dropped 16 pounds and I have at least another 15 to go that until I get to about where I was before I gain some weight back. Um, I'd actually technically like to lose about 25 or 30 more, but that's where I'm at. So let me share these ideas with you. So this is a brand that I found of yogurt. It's called Too Good. It only has two grams of sugar per serving. And you know, it's not super sweet, but it's also not plain. So, you know, they have um, about five different uh, kinds. I think there's vanilla, blueberry, peach, strawberry, and then like a mixed berry. I love this one and I always get it with, I always put like some fresh blueberries or strawberries on top. Every now and then if I have like those little miniature chocolate chips, if I'm having a chocolate craving, I'll put those on top. You can put slivered almonds on top, uh, you know, walnuts, pecans, any of that, but it's a great um, afternoon snack. It's a great morning snack and it definitely is a great evening snack if you're having a sweet tooth. So that's one idea. Another one that my daughter introduced me to, make sure you go over and check out her channel. It's called Jo Mama's Kitchen, J-O-M-A-M-A-S Kitchen. I'll put it in the link uh, below. I'll put her link in the comment section below. Um, but Jo Mama's Kitchen, she has a lot of amazing health ideas. She's starting to do some grocery hauls. She's starting to make her own laundry detergent, things like that. But she's the one that turned me on to this. And this is the Yasso. It is very, very, very hard to find. Let me just tell you that. Um, she finds it at Smith's, which is also a Fred Meyer chain. So any of you that have Fred Meyer or Smith's, you can find it there. Um, I actually found this one at Grocery Outlet, um, but they don't always have it. Like I went in today and this is the only kind they have where the other day they had two. So they don't always have it, but look for it. It's the Yasso. It's 130 calories per serving, which is a half a cup. Um, the sugar's are 16 grams for a half a cup, which is kind of high. But if you're having that that sugar craving or that ice cream craving, this is a good way to go. They also have ice cream bars and I love those. And I think the ice cream bars are 100 calories per bar. Um, I actually had one of those last night because I was having a craving. Those are hard to find as well, but not quite as hard as the ice cream. So look into that. Uh, another idea for midday snack, um, even at night as well, are these built bars. Now I have not found them in any stores at all. Um, I found them at builtbar.com and you had to buy them on there and then they have like different kinds or they have a variety pack. If you're a first time, per, uh, first time buyer, I do believe you can get $10 off your first order um, or you can buy multiple boxes and then you get more money off for every box you buy. But they are low in sugar. They have 110 calories per bar, 15 grams of protein, six grams of fiber, four grams of sugar and four grams of fat. It's a great snack and I do like them. They're kind of marshmallowy texture inside so I want to warn you about the texture but my favorite one I actually am out of. It's the chocolate raspberry. They also have a chocolate lemon and a chocolate orange and I like all of those. Next would be my coconut chocolate that I like and then I like the salted caramel. Not my favorite one. Um, 
And then they have a mint one, and I'm not a huge fan of that one, but these are really yummy if you're having a sweet craving and um, you want to just like hurry and satisfy that craving. Now, the last thing I'm going to show you is um, I make protein shakes every morning, and then there's sometimes in the afternoon when I'm like, I'm just so hungry, but I can't find anything healthy in my house. And so I will go ahead and make a protein shake, but my ones in the afternoon are different than my morning ones because the ones that I do in the morning are more to fill me you know, throughout the morning. These are just like a little quick snack. So I actually use um, the Orgain brand. I also have some through um, some MLM companies that I use, but this is the one that I use most often. This is the peanut butter Orgain uh, protein powder. I also like the vanilla bean. Those are my two favorite. The chocolate is good as well. Um, this one I had to get online. I got it at Amazon. Or did I get it at eBay? It was either, I, oh no, I got this one at Amazon. Um, but you can also get like the vanilla and the chocolate. A lot of times Costco has those. So I use that. I use one cup of the cashew milk, which is only 25 calories a serving. That's per the one cup. So that is really good. And there's zero grams of sugar. Um, I also like the unsweetened uh, vanilla almond milk. And I will use that as well. That it has I believe 30 or 40 calories per cup, but still a great alternative. Some people use coconut milk. Uh, you can use, you know, uh, my daughter's switched to the oat milk. I also know there's the flax milk, so you can try any of those. Um, I use a cup of that, a scoop of the protein powder. Sorry, my dogs are in the background. Um, and then sometimes I will add a scoop of peanut butter. Um, I'll measure it out. Now you can use almond butter or not anything at all. Just use the two together. I, <laughs> you're gonna think I'm weird, I use about a teaspoon or so of the apple cider unfiltered raw vinegar. Um, I get this at Grocery Outlet, it's a good price there. Um, but I do add a little bit to that because then I feel like, you know, that's, that helps clean out your system a little bit. It also helps burn fat. So that's my little secret ingredient. But when I add that, I don't like the tartness per se that it gives my protein shake. So then I usually add right about a teaspoon, not usually anymore, about a teaspoon of raw unfiltered honey now I get this one at Costco this one is $9.99 um, for this huge thing but you can also find raw and filtered honey in a lot of places so those are a few ideas of some healthy sweet snacks to cure that craving um, if you would like to see any more please give me a thumbs up let me know below um, if you enjoyed these let me know and um, remember to check out Joe Mama's Kitchen she is a mom of two amazing little boys. They're my grandsons. And she is just starting out and she's got some really, really cool ideas. And she's pretty shy and soft-spoken, but she's awesome. So anyway, I hope everyone has a wonderful day. Until next time, God bless.